Don't cry, child of God. It will come to pass. It will come to pass suddenly, says the Lord God. In Isaiah 48, verse 3, the Lord said, Behold, I told, I, I spoke of the former things out of my mouth. I announced them, I declared them, and it came to pass suddenly. That's what God's word says in Isaiah 48, verse 3. I want to release this word out to the heart of those that cry literally every now and then over the fact that they've been waiting for so long and God sees your tears. God feels your tears and, and feels the pain that you feel. And he's saying to you, it will come to pass. Behold, it will come to pass. Because his word in Isaiah 48 verse 3 says, Behold, I spoke of those things. Right? I, I uh, declared you know, these things. I made them known to you. God is saying, it will come to pass. And he's heard your cry. Because his word says, says in Psalms, it says that he hears the cry of the righteous. So I want you to be rest assured and be at peace that every cry that you've cried out unto the Lord, every cry of faith, cry of pain, whatever it is, God is saying, it will come to pass your expectations your belief your trusting in me for so and so it will come to pass just don't cry anymore child of god god doesn't want you to keep on crying over the situation you know and making it feel like he's not able to do it but i'm here to encourage you that child of god don't cry don't cry anymore put a smile on your face because god loves you jesus loves you okay if i was able to say jesus is crazy about you like i would use that word but that word doesn't matter but the Lord loves you so much and he has great things planned out for you and he doesn't want you to cry. He's saying to you, behold, it will come to pass. That thing you're believing me for, my child, listen, I will do it. I will perform. Don't you know who I am? I am the God that parted the Red Sea. I'm the God that healed the woman with the issue of blood. I'm the God that opened the eyes of the blind. I'm the God that caused the deaf to hear. My goodness, God loves you, okay? I am the God of miracles. I will display my power in your life. That is the word of the Lord for somebody in Jesus' mighty name. And I pray this word blesses you, child of God. Dry your eyes, okay? Don't cry in your spirit. Don't cry physically. Don't let the enemy see your tears, okay? Just, just you know, be strong in the Lord, okay? It's not the time to faint. It's the time to be in faith. And having just said that, you all, I have to announce very quickly Newman Gopu's shop is back up and running again. For some strange reason, over the last year, there was technical issues with the website, but now it's back up and running. And up there, we have inspirational, you know, uh, you know um, scriptures on every item from tank tops to uh, books, notebooks, uh, uh, mugs, tights, shorts, everything that you can put scripture on or design on or anything about Jesus. It's up. It's all up there. Hallelujah. Amen. We're wearing our faith. You all, we're not just speaking our faith. We are wearing our faith. Amen. Praise the Lord. So, child of God, don't cry. It will come to pass what God has spoken over you. Suddenly, it will come to pass in the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Declare over yourself, I refuse to cry anymore. I know it will come to pass suddenly. I refuse to cry anymore. I know it will come to pass suddenly in Jesus' mighty name. And so shall it be for you, child of God. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Let me just pray over you one more time. Father, in Jesus' mighty name, oh Lord, how awesome and wonderful you are. But I'm praying right now for everyone listening that may have been crying for one reason or the other. Oh Lord, have mercy upon your children. And I pray, Lord God, that you will bring to pass what you promised them, that they will not have a reason to cry any tears of pain or sorrow or agony or loss or illness anymore. Lord, dry their every tears, O oh Lord. They are your beloved Heavenly Father and bless them, O oh Lord, with the promises that you've given unto them. Let it come to pass suddenly because it is written in your word that you spoke of those former things. You declare them out of your mouth and suddenly they came to pass. Let it be so for them, Heavenly Father. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen and amen. God bless you all. I love you so much. But Jesus loves you much more than I can ever do.